Anyways, what's up? Um, today, first of all, peep the new hat. 10 bucks on the Cornwall Trek, best purchase of my entire life. But that's not what this video is about at all. This video is going to be about putting my Bill LSB inside of the actual Del Sol. So here we are with it already in. We're about three quarters of the way through the build process at this time. I do have some little things I gotta fix here and there. Basically, we're just gonna go through everything. I mean, I have a time lapse coming up just of getting the motor ready, putting everything back together and then getting it in the car. And then from there, we'll just kind of go where this video takes us. We're pretty close to being done so far. So let's get right into that. Crank it for a little bit first. Yeah, crank it so it actually gets the oil. Okay. Where's it go? The tripod, right? Huh? All right so where it goes where, that, where this tin is. I don't know where you're putting it. Right uh huh? Yeah. Oh, what? Like this. Oh, right. See which one's the one. There's no spark. Thank you. 
So I just want to quickly take a second and talk about why I wasn't getting any spark. So it all comes down to really the distributor here. This is one I bought that was supposed to fit the car, which it does. Um, but one thing we noticed, we think, uh, first of all, the igniter inside's bad because period, the end, nothing. But also, this will be hard to show you, but this shaft is totally jammed up. Like I can spin the whole thing around. Even if I hold it and try to turn, I can't get that to move. So that's most likely what's causing our no spark. Uh, we went ahead and bought a new distributor. We popped the leak. Looks like a, my sandwich plate was still a little loose, so I went ahead and tightened that up. Sorry, it was a little washed out. But anyway, hopefully that will stop that from leaking because it was basically just pissing oil everywhere. I don't know if you can tell, but this is like all a giant puddle. So the loud clacking you were hearing while running was because of a valve clearance issue. I went ahead and did all the valves. Like you saw that while I was building the motor. One thing I didn't realize is I actually left, I think it was this one on number three, totally loose somehow. So obviously it worked its way out and it was just sitting there like basically not even working. So I went ahead, readjusted all the valves again, caught most of them. There's a little bit of adjustment here and there. For the most part, things ran pretty smooth, but now it runs pretty dang well. There we go. It's significantly quieter now that I've got that fixed. So I'll have to go ahead and do a break-in procedure and a couple other things I did just want to touch on. First of all, I need to find some ways to plug these vacuum lines other than hoses and bolts. I need to do something with the throttle cable because this bracket's just not going to work. And they are kind of model specific. But things I have done so far to keep this running, uh, obviously replacing these. I don't know if anyone noticed so far, but totally trashed. So I went ahead and got some universal set to replace those. Pretty much everything else is just straightforward. I do have to figure out a couple little things like clutch slave cylinder line, a bracket for my radiator because my old car just didn't have one. And then just the power steering and AC and this car will be back together. Well, that pretty much marks the end of the video. We got the motor in the car and it's running. The next video I'm going to be working on is it driving. We're going to take it on its first drive. So if you're interested in that, please subscribe to the channel. Keep updated. That'll be coming out within this month. I'm very excited to see where this goes and I'm happy to say that I've got this far. Overall, I'm really impressed with this car and I feel like it's come a long way. So as always, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, leave those down below in the comments and have a wonderful day.